guys, welcome back. So I'm coming to you from my bathroom today. I'm going to be taking you through my self tanning routine, what I do to clean it off, what products I use, how I apply it, everything. So you can see how I get this nice glowy tan. All right, so if you wanna see how I got it, then just keep watching. Once a week, I take the St. Ives Fresh Skin Body Scrub. This is the apricot scrub. And I just take a bunch of that. I'm like almost out. I just take that onto my skin and I just put it on there. And then I put a lot. I just don't have a lot right this minute. But it, mine's already done. I just wanted to show you, I didn't play on this night, but I just want to show you the process. So I take, I just bought this like exfoliating um, towel from Walmart. It's a cheap one. I don't recommend it or anything. This is just what I have. And so I take that and I basically like scrub this into my skin. I mean, just like really scrub it because the tan is going to be wearing off. Even though the tan wears off very well on its own, the tanner, like you're gonna have little splotches if you leave it on for like a whole week. So I just go ahead and like get the rest of it off. I just, re I really scrub hard to get it off. It takes me a good hour to get this tanner off. All right, so you're going to wanna to put on some lotion on your bony prominences like your elbows, your feet, your hands, ankle bones. So I use the Nivea Essentially Enriched Body Lotion. This is what um, Makeup by Shayla uses to make her skin glow so good. And Shayla taught me. Hashtag. So let's go ahead and like just rub this into our hands and then you just rub it into your elbows and your knees i'm gonna really finish this off camera because i'm not trying to flash anybody and scare anybody so we're gonna do that off camera but you get my point take your feet and rub it all into your feet Yes. Okay. We're lotioned up and we're ready to apply our tanner. Okay. And my products I use for tanning, I use Loving Tan Deluxe Bronzing Mousse in the Ultra Dark. And I use these are dirty. These are these were not sent to me. I bought these and this is what I use. So they're dirty just like I use them. And this is the Loving Tan 2 Hour Express in the shade Dark. They don't have an Ultra Dark in the um, 2 Hour Express. So I that's what I use for my tanning product. Okay, so go ahead and first of all, I shake up my bottles. Just so if there's tanner sitting on the bottom, it's all mixed up. Okay. All right, and then go ahead and put on your mitt. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use the ultra dark on every, on like every, part except for like my bony spots so go ahead and just put you some in your mitt i gotta go light because my bottle is like almost empty and then go ahead and just rub it in i just keep going over it until i don't see any like splotches but if you do, I'm going to show you what to do. I probably put more than what you need 
The Loving Tan is about $40. And depending on how big your body is, I'm a 5'7 and I weigh about 168 pounds right now. I wish I didn't, but yes, I've gained about 30 pounds in the past four years. So that's about how big my body is. And it, I can probably get about five or six uses out of the bottle. Somebody with a smaller body can might probably get like eight. All right, so this is like the tan applied. And then what I'm gonna do is use, make sure I'm not flashing anybody. Then I'm going to go in with the two hour express and put that on the kabuki brush just a little bit and then i'm going to do my feet with that and so what i do is i just buff it in like kind of circular motions all into my feet you've got lotion on so you can get it everywhere because that lotion is going to be like kind of your buffer to make it not so intense because my skin is so white I have to go kind of under my foot otherwise it's going to be a big line there it looks really bad so I go under at all my spots so it when it does wear off it'll, it'll take about a week for it finally will come off and then it'll be time to reapply anyway so you won't really ever see the line there so what I, I just buff it everywhere up until I get to where I had put on the ultra dark I don't wash this off in two hours because I sleep in this. So I just put it on and I just wear it overnight. And I just buff it all down into my ankles. And there we have it. Make sure you go in between your toes. So it won't be just like the tops of your toes that are tan. Because I have done that. Alright, so that's how it looks. Okay guys, so this is how it looks after it's applied. There's my hands. And so I've got the 2 Hour Express on here in the shade Dark. And then the Deluxe Bronzing Mousse in the Ultra Dark here. So I just, I put a little bit more lotion um, on my hands after it dried and then I just took a like, just a, a washcloth and, I can't reach it. And then I just wiped the insides of my hands. So I got a little more lotion on there and so it won't take as deep. But I go ahead and put like an old long sleeve flannel shirt on. This is my like self tanning outfit for the night. I use it like every time I tan and so I like can pull the sleeves down and everywhere my body's covered so it won't be on my white sheets um, and I'll put on socks too and so nothing's really touched and then I lay a towel over my pillow so the back of my neck don't get on my pillowcases and it's not a comfortable night of sleep but I just try not to roll around too much or yeah, it's just an uncomfortable night. I do it on my nights off. So that's how it looks. And I will see you guys first thing in the morning and we'll wash it off and see what the final look is. All right, guys. All right, guys. So this is my tan after it's all finished. I've already took a shower and washed all the buffer off and put some lotion on. So this is what we have. Look at my hands. That's how my hands look. Loving Tan tells you to apply the two hour to your hand for about 30 minutes and then to wash it off. I don't like to wash it off. I just like to leave it on overnight, but I do go back in, like I said, and put that lotion on after it's sat for a while. So it'll there'll be something there to like not make it as dark on your hand. But that's how it looks. Let me show you my legs. Okay, so that's my legs. They come out really nice and golden. They 
the loving tan doesn't streak you don't have to worry about that so that's how they look okay so this is my feet they did really good there's no like of course i'm going to be white on the bottom of my foot that's why i said kind of go over the foot a little bit so as it wears off it'll wear off like from the bottom and you won't ever see the line so that there it's not like too dark around my ankles or anything it looks really good overall i'm really happy with my tan i'm not as dark as somebody would be who's already dark but I'm pasty pale white, so I've got like a good, nice golden color, and I'm happy with it. So, anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next one.